The Big Black Templar release has had its prices revealed this week, so let's see how much Hellbrecht and Grimaldus will set you back, and talk about the breakdown of the other Black Templar prices. Hello and welcome back to Warspets Tactics, where today I thought we'd just do a quick run through of the new Black Templar models, and how much they're going to cost when they go up for pre-order. Most of it's fairly in line with what I was expecting, but let's take a look through and talk about what we've got. So first up, Codex Black Templars is £17.50, $30 or €22.50, the same price as the other Space Marine Codex supplements, the ones like Blood Angels, Dark Angels and the like. Kind of to be expected, and to be honest for a Games Workshop book it's not really the worst deal in the world, they sell most of their codexes for £30 or US dollars but I would bear in mind that this is a supplement book rather than the main codex, so in theory if you actually want to use the rules, it's basically this on top of the normal Codex Space Marines, which does cost the same amount as the other books. Definitely a bit of a barrier towards getting Space Marines, though if you do already have the main Codex, picking this one up won't cost you as much extra compared with other books. Next up we have the miniatures, both Helbrecht and Grimaldus and his retinue are both £29.45 US dollars or €35. Euros. This seems to be Games Workshop's standard price for a big chunky character, it's the same amount as that Primaris Chaplain on bike cost for example. Both of these, I would say, are a little bit more bigger and impressive than your standard character miniatures. Helbrecht comes on this fairly solid scenic base with a dead orc and servitor attendants, and Grimaldus, of course, gets his three little servitors as a retinue. Still, though, certainly a touch more than other characters. Otherwise, for the miniatures, the new Sword Brethren squad are £34.50, $55, or €42.50. Euros. That's for five miniatures with their selection of power weapons. Again, perhaps kind of in keeping with the other Primaris Space Marine releases. A little bit more than the Blade Guard veterans, but of course you only get three models out of them. The Crusader squad is as exactly as I would have expected, £36.50, $60 or €45, Euros, being the same amount as the Assault Intercessor kits from the previous year. And the other models are all fairly standard character size miniatures. The Emperor's Champion is £23.50, $40 or €30, Euros, and both those Marshall and the Castella miniatures, they're £21.32 or €25. Euros. That's the price for each model, not the two combined. Fairly standard stuff. If you're looking to get Marshalls or Castellans on a budget though, I'm sure we could probably kitbash some decent ones out of Crusader Squad or Sword Brethren parts. I believe the Sword Brethren kit actually pushes you to build a Castellan out of one of the models as one different option. Finally, we have this Black Templar upgrade sprue, which was one of the more unusual releases. It's £21, $32 or €25. Euros. And I think that kind of makes sense, it's around about twice the size of the standard Space Marine upgrade sprues, and around about twice the price. I definitely feel it's a bit more interesting than some of the standard sprues, as you do get all the cosmetic effects and the shoulder pads and things, but you also get some fun different weapon options, such as Neophyte shotguns, the Relic sculpted in plastic, and the Bolt-on multi-melter for the Repulsor. Finally, there's the usual Codex accessories, the dice and the data cards. The dice have got the Black Templar's logo on, as you'd expect and the data cards have the usual stratagems and things. Overall, I'd say there's no real massive surprises here, pretty much what I'd expect based on Games Workshop's previous releases. Let me know what you think down in the comments below, particularly if either of these prices have put you off, or incentivise you to get some of the models that you might not have. If you've enjoyed the video, and you want to keep up more with Games Workshop's news and releases, I'll certainly try and cover them on All Specs Tactics, in addition to all our regular scheduled 40k tactics content. Hopefully there should be a few more videos out for the Black Templars before very long. Feel free to check out the channel's Patreon page and Element Games affiliate link down in the video description. Both of those are what help support the channel and keep new videos like this coming, so give them a click if you're interested. In any case, an absolutely massive thank you for listening, and I'll hope to see you guys next time.